Hey guys, it's Whoop Jaggle. Today, I'm going to show you how to pretty easily solo the Ascendant Challenge, at least this week's. I know it was around a couple weeks ago too. Uh, some of the guys in my clan and, and, and some buddies are kind of struggling, especially with Hunter, to get back um, to the chest or whatever on this one. I'm probably gonna do a video later on how to get to and get the eggs in there, but I need to watch a couple vids and it's gonna require some sword flying, but one of the one of the main things and the main pieces you're gonna see me doing here is light swinging with the sword. It will pull you at like a five degree downward angle. You can go an incredible distance and not drop very far. Um, so you'll see kind of what's going on. We're gonna go crush some ads real quick. I need to pop a tincture. Um, boom, boom, boom. All right. Just doing a quick vid. It's not like a, you know, it's not like a how-to on how to freaking solo Crota or anything. It's just a quick, kind of. it's just kind of an annoying Ascendant challenge. It's not like it's super tough, but uh, folks are struggling getting cucked by the rocks. And, you know, we all know this one's kind of a pain in the ass. So getting over there's no problem. I want to make sure uh, real quickly before I go, uh, I just start out on Orpheus Rig so I get my tether back in case I have to redo this. Uh, and then I'm going to switch to uh, Stompies later on so oh i went the hard way i thought this was the other one definitely went the hard way is it hard not really wow definitely took the long way there though 100 percent do 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 yeah we're just gonna go over here and cuck these guys real quick I figure out my direction. That was a goofy ass route. These guys are so elusive. And the aim assist you get, the uh, hip fire aim assist, really? The hip fire aim assist that you get is insane, man. I'm just gonna tether these guys again, why not? Key to this, honestly, is uh, let's get these guys freed up. There's one more dude. What's going on? There he is. See that? I couldn't. Wow, if I could hit a shot. I literally am not doing anything. It's like pulling me around so bad. If you light swing and heavy swing right away, you will down slam like right away. And just keep driving at this. At this dude, I'm kind of getting cucked from the back here. I might get out of here real quick. Let this guy come down to me. Got him isolated, sort of. As soon as we get our, our ah, I'm just gonna keep working on this dude. As soon as we get our super swing, we're just gonna go like that. You can give a heavy swing, then a super swing, and you're done. So just keep driving at him, because everything that's attacking you, right, is gonna surround you, but it's gonna be, um, it's gonna be killed by your ground slam. So just keep ground slamming. And then when you get your super swing, ground slam, and then immediately hit your super buttons afterwards, and it will actually give you both attacks. So, like, pomp, pomp, just like that. Uh, if I could... There, jeez. What the hell? Why was I having such a hard time finding that? All right, so what we're going to do is we're actually going to jump up on we might as well do that one i guess it doesn't really matter we're gonna get up on one of those things so you need your stompies on for sure uh hunter mantle sucks absolutely um so we're just gonna get up to this part right here and press forward until he mantles onto this thing we're gonna take a few quick jumps see that swing didn't work so we're gonna get back up there it's gonna take a couple probably this is really hard. Nope, didn't go high enough. He will not mantle on that sconce. He will mantle with every other class. Nope, my jumps are really bad right now. Might take you a few tries for sure, but if you can touch that thing where you can get your jump back, you'll be good. Is 
There we go. Nope. See how I'm light swinging? And it's getting me around really, really well. Okay, this might be it. Yeah, this is it, 100%. We basically passed over that sconce. It's ridiculous. But you see, I mean, it even took me a few tries. I just had it down where I could, it was very repeatable, but I, I still couldn't get it very well. So you can make it up there, or you can jump, like, as high as you can right there and uh and then sword swing over to it because you can jump up above this lip so it's no problem getting up here but you need to sword swing once you get up to that sconce sometimes you'll mantle but like one out of a hundred tries you know what i mean uh but yeah just keep sword swinging and sort of aim out a little bit away from the wall until you pass over that sconce and then you should have your jump back so all you need to do from this point is get real friendly with that light swing button that's it we're spamming light swing Pretty much straight there. Uh, that's it. Thanks for tuning it in. <laughs> that's basically it. Spam that light swing. You know you could probably make it from that lower, but why not, you know, why not jump up to the higher? That's it. That way you don't have to mess with any of the rocks, anything like that. You just have to goof around with that jump up to the gazebo or whatever that thing is. Or the jump up to the sconce, actually, on the wall. And like I said, with Titan, you can use the same technique with Titan. Um, I sword flew with, like, uh, catapult lift. You know, it did the actual sword fly. But you could, again, with any character that will get that high um, to go up to the main building, you can just fly over here. And I'm pretty sure you could fly from the gazebo, too. So... Yeah, uh, I'm probably going to look up, you know, where those eggs are because I need them too. So I'm going to like maybe do a video on that. But thanks for tuning in. We'll catch you in the next one.